Hello students I hope you are doing great so in this video we are going to do word on Oxford countdown book 5 third edition so now let's get started let me show you the page the page that we are doing in this video is 77 and the chapter is decimals and percentages and the exercise is exercise 4b and the questions that we are doing in this video is question number 5 and now let's read it solve the following sums so we gotta solve these sums but we are not doing all of the sums we are just doing c and d part okay i will do all of the parts in the next video for now i will just do c and d okay in this question so now let's get started so in this question we basically got to do divide okay and I hope you know how to do divide and if you don't I will tell you okay let's get started so first you see the number it is 1.35 divided by 15 let me show you how to write it you take your marker or pencil whatever you have and put your line like it's uh, you people call it in divide this block is a house okay and in it you write one then point then three and then five okay and then what you do you divide it from 15 like this so now let's get started so you know what we got to do is we are doing in the same method all we are doing is we're putting points so first we gotta find one then we gotta find three and then we gotta find five okay but i don't think we can find one but we will still see so you know 15 is a big number and we cannot talk and say that so we gotta write it but let me tell you how to also write it first you put 15 like this and then your number like this okay and then you multiply it now we will do it all the way to 9 okay not to 10 only to 9 so 0 5 are 0 0 1 is 0 and can you write 15 i hope you know this that if you have only um, one number down you will just do it to the both two numbers on the top so 1 5 are 5 1 1 are one okay and then you go to your next part like this there you go it is perfect so two five are ten and you put one here two one are two and in two when you add one it is three so it may will make thirty and then you do it for like this what is 3 5 are 15 so 5 here 1 here 3 1 are 3 and in 3 when you add another one it makes 4 so it is 45 i hope you can see now let's go to this area and we are going to do it just like i tell you all the way to 9 so i will do it all the way to 9 so 4 5 are 20 so 0 here and 2 here 4 1 are 4 and in 4 when you add 2 it makes 6 so it is here it is 6 16 i mean 16 i mean 60 okay not 16 then the next one is 5 i hope you know 5 5 are 25 so 5 here and 2 here 5 1 are 5 and in 5 when you add 2 it is 7 so 75 like this and then you do it to 6 6 5 are 30 so when I write 0 here and 3 here 6 1 are 6 and in 6 when you add 3 it is 9 so 90 and then from 15 you do 7 7 5 are 35 so 5 here and 3 here and then 
and seven one are seven but in seven when you add three it makes ten so ten here like this and then you put 15 here and 8 there and then you multiply it okay now you go and do it we will just put a little more up for you guys to see better like this and in 18 i mean 8 so we write 8 here and 8 5 are 40 so 4 0 here i mean 0 not 4 here okay 0 and 4 here so 8 1 are 8 in 8 when you add 9 I mean in 8 when you add 4 how many you make 12 okay so like this and the last number is 9 so right here it almost take up so much I mean yeah and in 9 9 5 are 90, 95 I mean 45 and so 5 here and 4 here and in it you will so 9 1 are 9 and in 9 when you will add 4 how many will it mean 13 yes 13 so let's now do it oh and I think I already found our answer I think it is very simple and easy but let's see hmm. okay so first what we do is I gotta find one but if we stop looking at the point it will make one three five and one three five is also here so what if we add a point here will it make the right answer no it won't because you see there's a point so as you know in divide you do every number not like just one there should be a point there then we will do since there is a not point we will do it not like that so now we have no number match to one so i guess we are doing then one three five because there is no 35 anywhere or that's why that's why i think this is our correct answer it is from nine remember only do it if you think that there is no other number matches to these numbers okay then only write the number like this one let me show now how to write it one and you will leave the you know gap right here and then you write three and then you write five because you have to find all of the numbers in the first time that's why you know you need to you know then check again then check again you can just do it in the first row okay so there is also zero here zero here and then zero here and then you will put this point okay i mean you can also put a point here but it's better if you point is in your this answer which is also you can call it your remainder but it is better if you point put a point right here and i mean it's also better to put a point right here but it is not that much good that you should put a point right here okay so now let's go to our next part which is part b and this part is part c okay now let's go to part d and it will not fit here we have to go to the next page to do it and the part d is 4.67 multi i mean one sorry that wasn't the question this was our question okay and this is 1.44 divided by 12 so now let's do it it will be long as that one was but i hope we can do it Again, you write a make. I mean, you make a house. Then you write the number outside twelve. Then you put one point forty four, and then I guess you start multiplying again, just like I told you. Because if you know how does the table system everything go, then you can write it. But since some people don't know, that's why I have to write everything. Okay. So as you know, it's zero. All right, and the next one is I hope you know twelve one are 
Well, twelve to R twenty four. Twelve three R thirty six. I hope you can see. Let me just put it again a little up. Thirty six. And then twelve four R forty eight. I hope you can see. And then twelve. Ten here, so we are going to write zero here and one here. Five one or five, and then five when you add one, it is sixty like that. And I'm really sorry for the voice at the back, but it have to come. So yes, twelve. So two here and one here. Six one or six in six when you add one it is seventy two. Two seven or fourteen so four here and one here and seven one or seven in so seven one or seven and in seven when you add one it is eight so eighty four and the Second last number is a. So two eight are sixteen. So six here, one here, eight one are eight, and then in eight when you add one, it is ninety six like that. And then the last number is nine. So again we do here. So. Two nine are eighteen, so eight here and one here, so nine one are nine, and in nine one are ten, it is one zero eight. So now let's do it. Let's see when how many numbers we can find. Um, we gotta find fourteen first. Do you see fourteen? No, no, only the closest to fourteen is I mean to one or fourteen. Eh? Is twelve okay? So we are going to use twelve. So one here, and I just like I told you. Point is I mean okay, but no. You can put point, but it is better if you put it in your answer. Okay, you just now you do separate. If you don't think that okay, we gotta put point in every reason. No, only the point will come in your answer. Okay. Oh, and I forgot to tell you. And since this is a big number, you also put a point right here. Okay, like that. So I'll do it. So one one is zero, and in four when you minus two, it is two. Okay. And then you put this one down, so it's twenty-four. Let's see, can we find twenty-four? Yes, we can. It is right here. So from two, we can find twenty-four. So right here. Now we will subtract it. So zero and zero point zero. Okay, and this was your remember remainder. And this was the part D, okay. And this is how you do question number five. And I will do all of the parts, all of the questions in the coming up videos. For now, hope you like the video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. Okay, bye. See you in the coming up videos.